Hola, welcome to Jericho's Mukbang. So, my wife has me obsessed with anime lately, and I've been finding different places here in Austin. And look what I found. I've been dying to try these. So, I'm gonna try one. This one is the authentic tuna mayo. And it comes in seaweed and rice. So we're going to see. It's in a Japanese place. You have like Japanese women making them actively. So I think you do this, right? Oh, whoops, I did it wrong already. All right, peel. Oh, call me a mukbanger. And then, oh shit, oh, all right, because it keeps it nice and fresh, and do the other side, a lot of crumbs, a lot of crumbs, it's crumbs, all right, right, and then you just take a I mean, it's just rice and tuna. I swear. I mean, it's not bad. But, or like, I can make this at home. Rice and tuna with seaweed. I swear, these YouTubers be making, they be like, good but it tastes good though like there's some good ass tuna but I'm coming at home ooh 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 thank you for watching Jerrica's mukbang alright I got one more thing you know it wasn't too bad Ooh, it wasn't too bad. It's all right. It just we needed some like platano, like a little plantain or a little something on the side. But now we have a bento box, girl. Get it ready for my Asia trip. It is rice, kinpira, tamago, yaski, and shibazuki. Hey. Look at that. They, they make it here. And you can order like your own bento box. So I just ordered one that, not ordered. I just picked up one that they had. All right. I'm all in. Hold on. Not ready. Sauce. I will say, these people really like, um, Okay, let's try, let's try this first. The meats, with, without the sauce. With the sauce. So this is like a fried pork chop. All right, let's see with some rice. All right, and we dunk it. Oh, it's gonna fall. Hold on. Boo boo ass. rice and pork. All right, let me see here. A little th tomato. I mean, 
It's very basic. I think it's because I'm Hispanic. There's this weird thing here that we can try. There you go. No. I don't know what this is. It's pickly. And then let's try this with a little. Okay. <laughs> it's bamboo shoots, I think. And this is a deal. It's an A. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Alright, so let's let's combine it, okay, okay? So we're gonna do some uh some arrow, some foil, right? Use some whack ass chopsticks with this and the A. And we're going to layer it. All right. Ready? Let's see. Oh, no, so. It's not bad. Alright. It's good when you mix everything together. Alright. Bye. Alright. So. I'm real curious about this one. Got one more before I head out. This one is. Abu Rami, so Abu Ra, let's see. Yeah, Ab Abu Ra Miso. Abu Ra Miso. It is cooked rice, sesame seaweed, pork loin, miso, sugar, grated ginger, and, and sea salt. Ready for. We are gonna try this one because it's warm and I don't want to get to the cribble and it's like cold. Cause like, how the hell you warm this up? You feel me? So, and the ladies just like me them. All right, let's go. If this one ain't good, it's a wrap. All right. Hmm. All right. Oh, I smell seaweed. All right. Ah. Well, all I got was rice. The rice is okay. Hmm. I know. People be lying, bro. 